In this video, I will show you how to set up JavaScript and run JavaScript from Visual Studio Code. First of all, to run JavaScript from Visual Studio Code, we need to install Node. Go to Google and type download Node. And here, click on this first result from nodejs.org. Let it open and you need to choose which one do you want to install. So, click on Windows Installer. By default, it will download the x64 version. Once this is downloaded, click on Open File and your installer will open. Click next, accept the terms in the license agreement, click next again, click next again, click next and click next again. So now this is installing our Node.js. So as you can see here it shows the message Node.js has been successfully installed. So click on finish and now let's see if it works or not from command line. Press the windows key and type cmd, open command prompt and then type node dash dash version. So as you can see here, the node version is 18.16.0. After node is installed, let's create a project for JavaScript first. So right click and create a new folder. So this is my JavaScript folder. Now inside this folder, right click and open terminal and we will open this folder in Visual Studio Code. Once the terminal is open, what you need to do is just type code space full stop period dot whatever you call it and hit enter and Visual Studio Code will open and this folder will be open in Visual Studio Code. So as you can see here, my JavaScript folder is open here. So let's create a new file and let's call it main.js and save it inside this folder itself. So we have this main.js. Now let's write some JavaScript code here. I've just copy pasted a sample from Bing here. Now let's save this and open terminal and now that we have node installed we can directly run this using node like node main.js but typing every time and running using this node main.js yes, is not very intuitive so we can install some fancy extensions using which we can run this so to do that let's go to your extensions here and type code runner and this will help you run a lot of code as you can see here C, C++, Java and all this stuff and install this. So just after this is installed, you can close this and you can see you'll see this new icon here that will say run code. So now you can just click on this and your code is run as you can see here. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.